This is Smart Trend News. I'm Christy Duffy. Today is Friday, January 14th. This is your Closing Bell Market Wrap-Up. The major U.S. equity indices closed higher Friday, following stronger-than-expected earnings from J.P. Morgan Chase and as other banks helped to drive stocks higher. The People's Bank of China boosted its reserve requirement ratio for banks by half a percentage point. The ratio determines the amount of money that lenders must keep on reserve. It has been lifted several times over the past year. The Labor Department reported that the consumer price index increased half a percent in December, driven by a 4.6 percent gain in energy prices, in line with consensus estimates, which is the fastest increase in energy prices in more than two years. The Commerce Department reported that U.S. retail sales rose six-tenths of a percent in December, which is the sixth straight monthly increase as consumers bought more goods from online retailers, drug stores, and building supply companies. In corporate news, J.P. Morgan reported its fourth quarter earnings early this morning, posting an EPS of $1.12, topping estimates of $0.99. Cents. Net revenue in the quarter rose 6 percent year over year to $26.7 billion, better than the $24.4 billion analysts were expecting. The first $17.4 billion of net income is up 48 percent versus the year ago period. Wells Fargo shares closed 2.7 percent higher at $32.75 and Bank of America shares closed three and a quarter percent higher at $15.25 on hopes that the banks would be able to raise dividends after having to slash their dividends during the financial crisis. Taking a look at where the major U.S. indices closed on Friday, the Dow Jones Industrial Average closing half a percent higher at 11,787. The S&P 500 closing three quarters of a percent higher, 1,293. And the Nasdaq Composite closing three quarters of a percent higher, 2,755. For further updates, stay tuned. You're watching Smart Trend News. I'm Chrissy Duffy.